Hey there, goal getters. Today's video, where we're diving into a game changing strategy for sticking to your goals. Have you ever found yourself fired up about a new goal, only to lose steam a few weeks later? Trust me, I've been there too. I remember a few years back when I set a goal to read 50 books in a year. I started strong, plowing through the first few books with enthusiasm. But as the weeks went by, life got busy and my reading habit slowly fizzled out. Sound familiar? That's when I discovered the power of habit stacking. It's a simple yet incredibly effective technique that can help you build lasting routines and achieve your goals with more ease and consistency. By attaching new habits to existing ones, you create a seamless flow that makes it easier to stay on track. In this video, we're going to explore the ins and outs of habit stacking. We'll break down the psychological principles behind it, share real-life success stories, and equip you with practical strategies to create your own habit stacking routine. Whether you're looking to establish a regular exercise regimen, develop a daily meditation practice, or crush your professional goals, habit stacking can be your secret weapon. So, grab a notepad and pen, because you'll want to take some notes as we dive into the transformative world of habit stacking. Let's unlock the secret to sticking to your goals and making lasting change. Are you ready? Let's go. So what exactly is habit stacking and how can it help you build better routines to achieve your goals? Habit stacking is a simple yet powerful technique where you attach a new small habit or action you wanna build onto an existing habit that is already ingrained in your daily life. The idea is that by linking the new habit to an established one, like brushing your teeth or making your morning coffee, you make it much easier to remember and follow through consistently. Over time, the new habit becomes automatic, effortlessly integrating into your routine. Let me share a real-life example to illustrate how well habit stacking works. Sarah had always struggled to maintain a regular exercise routine, despite her best intentions. But then she discovered habit stacking. She decided to do 10 squats every morning right after brushing her teeth. It was such a small action that she barely noticed the extra effort. Within a few weeks, the squats became second nature and she no longer had to remind herself. She then stacked on another habit, doing 10 push-ups right after the squats. Gradually, Sarah built up a 10-minute mini workout routine, all thanks to habit stacking. So what's the psychology behind why habit stacking is so effective for achieving goals? It all comes down to the power of cues and rewards in shaping our behavior. By attaching a new habit to an existing one, you're essentially using the old habit as a cue or trigger for the new behavior. Over time, your brain starts to associate the two actions. As you complete the new habit consistently, you experience a sense of accomplishment which acts as a reward, reinforcing the behavior. This feedback loop strengthens the neural pathways, making the habit more automatic. Additionally, habit stacking reduces the cognitive load and willpower needed to initiate a new behavior. You're not relying on motivation or remembering to do it. The existing habit acts as a built-in prompt. To recap, Habit stacking offers a simple formula for building powerful routines by attaching new habits to existing ones. By leveraging the psychology of cues and rewards, you can make goal achievement feel more effortless and automatic. In the next section, we'll explore how to identify your keystone habits that can serve as the foundation for your habit stacking success. Now that you understand the basics of habit stacking, let's dive into a crucial aspect identifying your keystone habits. Keystone habits are those core routines or behaviors that have a ripple effect on your overall lifestyle and goal achievement. They serve as the foundation upon which you can stack additional positive habits. To identify your keystone habits, start by reflecting on your personal goals. Ask yourself, what are the most important areas of my life that I want to improve? Which habits, if developed, would have the greatest impact on these areas? Are there any existing routines that I can leverage to build new habits? For example, if your goal is to improve your physical health, 
A keystone habit could be establishing a consistent morning exercise routine. By prioritizing this habit, you create a domino effect that influences other health-related behaviors throughout your day, such as making healthier food choices or maintaining better posture. Research has shown that keystone habits have a profound impact on overall behavior change and goal attainment. In his book, The Power of Habit, Charles Duhigg highlights the transformative power of keystone habits. He cites examples of individuals who, by focusing on one critical habit, were able to catalyze positive changes in multiple areas of their lives. For instance, a study conducted by researchers at the University of New Mexico found that individuals who successfully developed the keystone habit of regular exercise experienced spillover effects in other domains. They reported, improved eating habits, reduced alcohol consumption, increased productivity at work, better stress management. By identifying and prioritizing your keystone habits, you can harness their potential to drive meaningful change and accelerate your progress towards your goals. Take a moment to reflect on your personal goals and the habits that could serve as keystones in your journey. Consider the following questions. What are the core habits that align with your values and aspirations? How can you create a supportive environment to nurture these keystone habits? What small steps can you take today to begin building momentum? Remember, identifying your keystone habits is a personal process that requires introspection and self-awareness. Trust your intuition and be open to experimentation. As you embark on your habit stacking journey, Celebrate the small victories and remain committed to the process of continuous growth and improvement. Now that you understand the power of habit stacking and have identified your keystone habits, it's time to dive into creating your personalized habit stacking routine. This process is all about being intentional, starting small, and building momentum over time. To create your habit stacking routine, follow these steps. Write down your existing daily habits and routines, such as brushing your teeth, having breakfast, or checking your email. Identify the new habits you want to incorporate based on your goals and the keystone habits you've identified. Choose an existing habit or routine that you can anchor your new habit to. For example, if you want to start meditating, you could attach it to your morning coffee routine. Create a clear and specific plan for your habit stack such as, after I pour my morning coffee, I will meditate for five minutes. Start implementing your habit stack, focusing on consistency and repetition to solidify the new behavior. One of the keys to successful habit stacking is to start small and gradually incorporate new habits over time. Trying to overhaul your entire routine at once can be overwhelming and unsustainable. Instead, focus on adding one small habit at a time, and give yourself time to adjust before adding another. For example, if your goal is to establish a morning exercise routine, start by doing just five minutes of stretching after you wake up. Once that becomes a consistent habit, you can gradually increase the duration or intensity of your workout. Building new habits isn't always easy, and you may face challenges along the way. Here are some tips for overcoming obstacles and staying consistent with your habit stacking routine. Anticipate potential barriers and plan ahead for how you'll deal with them. Use visual cues or reminders to trigger your habit stack, such as placing your running shoes by the door. Celebrate your successes and progress, no matter how small they may seem. Be patient and compassionate with yourself if you slip up or miss a day. Just get back on track as soon as possible. Having accountability partners or using tracking tools can be incredibly helpful in maintaining your habit stacking routine. Consider finding a friend, family member, or online community who shares similar goals and can support you on your journey. You can check in with each other regularly, share progress, and offer encouragement. There are also many apps and tools available that can help you track your habits and stay motivated. Some popular options include Habitica, Habit Bowl, and Streaks. These tools often include features like reminders, progress tracking, and rewards to keep you engaged and on track. Remember, 
Building new habits takes time and effort, but with a well-crafted habit stacking routine and the right support systems in place, you can achieve your goals and transform your life one small step at a time. All right, now that you've set up your habit stacking routine, it's crucial to keep tabs on your progress. Tracking your habits is like having a GPS for your goals. It helps you stay on course and make adjustments when needed. So why is tracking progress so important? Well, it's simple. What gets measured gets managed. By regularly monitoring your habit stacking routine, you can see how far you've come and celebrate your successes. Identify areas where you might be struggling or falling short. Make data-driven decisions to optimize your routine. Plus, seeing your progress on paper or in an app can be a huge motivator to keep going, even on days when you're not feeling it. Now, let's talk about how to actually measure the impact of your habit stacking on your goals. Here are a few ways to do it. Track the frequency and consistency of your habits, e.g., I meditated five out of seven days this week. Monitor the outcomes related to your goals, e.g., I lost two pounds this month, or I wrote ten pages of my novel. Reflect on how you feel and function as a result of your habits, e.g., I have more energy and focus in the mornings. The key is to choose metrics that are meaningful to you and your specific goals. And remember, progress isn't always linear. There will be ups and downs, but the overall trend is what matters. As you track your progress, you might find that some parts of your habit stacking routine are working well, while others could use some tweaking. That's totally normal. Here are some strategies for adjusting your routine based on feedback and results. If a habit isn't sticking, try making it smaller or attaching it to a different anchor habit. If you're consistently skipping a habit, ask yourself if it's truly aligned with your goals and values. If not, it's okay to let it go. If you're feeling overwhelmed, try focusing on just one or two keystone habits until they feel automatic, then gradually add more. The beauty of habit stacking is that it's flexible and customizable. Don't be afraid to experiment and find what works best for you. Finally, I want to emphasize the importance of reflection and adaptation in long-term habit formation. Set aside time regularly, maybe weekly or monthly, to review your progress, celebrate your wins, and identify areas for improvement. As you reflect, ask yourself questions like, What's working well in my habit stacking routine? What challenges am I facing and how can I overcome them? Are my current habits still serving my goals or do I need to make changes? Remember, building lasting habits is a journey, not a destination. By staying curious, compassionate, and committed to the process, you'll be amazed at the progress you can make over time. Despite our best intentions, Sticking to our habit stacking routines and achieving our goals can sometimes feel like an uphill battle. It's important to recognize that setbacks and obstacles are a natural part of the journey, and with the right strategies, we can overcome them and stay on track. When it comes to habit stacking and goal adherence, there are a few common challenges that many of us face. Procrastination, putting off tasks or habits, often due to lack of motivation or prioritization. Lack of motivation, feeling uninspired or disengaged, making it harder to stick to your habits. Setbacks, experiencing unexpected obstacles or failures that disrupt your progress. Recognizing these obstacles is the first step in developing strategies to overcome them. Here are some practical tips for tackling procrastination, lack of motivation, and setbacks. Break tasks into smaller, manageable steps to make them less daunting. Set clear deadlines and accountability measures to keep yourself on track. Celebrate small wins and progress to maintain motivation. Reframe setbacks as learning opportunities and adjust your strategies accordingly. Beyond practical strategies, overcoming challenges in habit stacking requires a shift in mindset. Embrace a growth mindset, recognizing that obstacles are opportunities for learning and improvement. Focus on progress over perfection, and be kind to yourself when setbacks occur. Remember, consistency and perseverance are key to long-term success. Take inspiration from individuals who have overcome obstacles 
through habit stacking. One example is author James Clear, who credits habit stacking for helping him write consistently and publish his best-selling book, Atomic Habits, despite facing numerous rejections and setbacks along the way. What challenges have you faced in your habit stacking journey and how have you overcome them? Share your experiences in the comments below. In today's digital age, technology can be a powerful ally in our quest to build and maintain positive habits. By leveraging the right tools and apps, we can supercharge our habit stacking routines and stay on track towards our goals. Incorporating technology into your habit stacking journey offers several key advantages. Automation. Apps can send reminders, track progress, and provide insights, reducing the mental load of managing your habits. Accountability. Sharing your progress with friends or a community through apps can boost motivation and accountability. Gamification. Many habit tracking apps use game-like elements such as streaks, rewards, and challenges to make the process more engaging and fun. Data-driven insights. By tracking your habits over time, you can gain valuable insights into your patterns, triggers, and areas for improvement. Two key features to look for in a habit stacking app are reminders and gamification. Reminders serve as external triggers, prompting you to complete your habit stack at the right time and place. Gamification elements like points, badges, and leaderboards tap into our natural desire for reward and competition, making the habit building process more engaging and motivating. By combining the power of technology with the proven strategy of habit stacking, you'll be unstoppable in pursuing your goals. Start exploring these tools today and see which ones resonate with your lifestyle and preferences. Remember, the best app is the one you'll actually use consistently. I'd love to hear from you. What are your favorite apps or tools for building and tracking habits? Share your recommendations in the comments below and let's help each other level up our habit stacking game. Let's talk about how habit stacking can help you develop a growth mindset and build resilience as you work towards your goals. When you consistently practice positive habits, it has a powerful effect on your mindset and self-improvement. Think about it this way. Every time you complete a habit stack, you're proving to yourself that you have the discipline and capability to change. You're demonstrating that you can commit to something and follow through. Over time, this builds confidence and a belief that you can take on new challenges and continue growing. Here are a few reflective questions to ask yourself as you build your habit stacking routine. What areas of personal growth am I focusing on with my habit stacks? How can I reframe obstacles as opportunities to learn and improve? What positive self-talk can I use to encourage myself when habit stacking feels challenging? Research has shown a strong link between habits, mindset, and achieving goals. A study published in the Journal of Research in Personality found that people who believed they could change their habits and abilities through effort, a growth mindset, were significantly more likely to achieve their goals compared to those with a fixed mindset. So as you continue with your habit stacking journey, remember that you're not just changing your actions, you're shifting your entire perspective. Embrace the process of growth, celebrate your progress, and keep pushing forward. With consistency and a growth mindset, you can accomplish incredible things. Research has consistently shown that social support plays a crucial role in habit formation and goal attainment. When you have a network of people who believe in you and support your efforts, you're more likely to stay committed to your habit stacking routine. Their positive influence can help you overcome obstacles, celebrate your successes, and maintain a growth mindset. Sharing your habit stacking journey with others offers numerous benefits. Accountability. When you share your goals and progress with others, you create a sense of accountability. Knowing that others are aware of your commitments can motivate you to follow through and stay consistent. Inspiration and ideas, engaging with a community allows you to learn from others' experiences. You can gain valuable insights, discover new strategies, and find inspiration from those who have successfully incorporated habit stacking into their lives. Emotional support. 
Building habits and achieving goals can be challenging at times. Having a supportive community means you have people to turn to during difficult moments, offering encouragement and understanding.